The Mungo, Mongoose, is a German air transportable multi-purpose transport vehicle. The Mungo is armored and highly mobile. It was jointly designed by Krauss Maffei Wegmann and Rainmetal specially for the German paratroopers. The Mungo is intended to be used in 30 to 40 kilometers radius around drop zones. Eventually this transport vehicle was adopted by the German army. The US Marine Corps bought some Mungos for trials and evaluation. The Mungo offers better protection than most smaller 4x4 light utility vehicles. It has armored sides. It also offers high level of protection against anti-personnel mines. Add-on armor against 7.62mm armor-piercing rounds can be installed. Sometimes a 7.62mm machine gun is mounted on top of the roof. Troops can use their weapons to shoot out of the vehicle. This light utility vehicle can transport 10 troops or 2,000 kilograms of cargo. It can be converted into cargo truck in less than 5 minutes. Mungo uses commercially available multi-car 4x4 chassis. Vehicle is powered by a 2.8-liter diesel engine, developing 105 horsepower. The engine is located in the middle of the vehicle. However the Mungo had not proved practical in Afghanistan. Suspensions and axles of the Mungo have been criticized as being not robust enough to withstand harsh terrain conditions. This light transport vehicle can be airlifted under slung by the CH-47 Chinook and CH-53G helicopters or inside most medium transport aircraft. Variants Mungo 1 Basic Troop Carrying Variant Mungo 2 Multipurpose Platform, which can be used as supply carrier, repair vehicle, NBC reconnaissance or medical evacuation vehicle. Mungo 3 has a larger completely protected cabin. It can be used to carry supplies and equipment. Belgian Light Troop Transport Vehicle It is a broadly similar vehicle. In 2017 Belgian Council of Ministers approved proposal to equip Belgian Special Operations Forces with 199 new armored transport vehicles, similar in concept to the German Mungo. These will replace in-service unarmored Unimogs. The Belgian vehicle has modular design and may be reconfigured to suit mission requirements. Its armor will provide protection for the occupants against small arms fire, artillery shell splinters, grenades, bomblets, and some degree of protection against land mines. Add-on armor kit is also a part of this acquisition. Deliveries are expected from 2019 to 2021.